Piers Pickup, episode 8. Um, in this one, it's just a short one. You know in the last episode I shoot a bit of metal with the drive side rear arch for the butt bit. Um, just going to get that cut today. Going to work out the back sheet that goes along where the rear lights will be on the back side of the butt. I'm going to work out that. Um, and also I'm going to have to weld a bar in at some point. I don't know if I'm going to do the weld in this episode. I probably will. But um, we shall see. Um, so yeah, just a few little bits now for the buck. I did say I weren't going to show you much till it's done. But I'm just going to show you a little bit in the middle there. And hopefully the next episode it will be somewhat done. So um, yeah, please stay tuned and uh, see how it goes. Right, and I watched the last video, episode 7, and the last, the second from the last clip, I said to you about that bit of metal with the um, outline on it for the side, and you couldn't really see it. So, I've gone over it again, I've got a new pen today, it's a good pen actually. Can you see it better? Hopefully you can. Um, I'm going to get this cut out, I'll start doing that now, and then uh, test the insides up, see how it looks. But, uh, yep, before I show you, so there it is. Peace! Um, so yeah, now I'm going to start cutting this out, it has just started raining, so uh, I'll do what I can. Um, I lost my last goggles, these aren't the best goggles in the world to use, but some are better than none, so I don't care how silly I look, I'm wearing them. metal's all cut out, um, I'm just sizing up to this, you can have a look. I have trimmed this bit here a few times to get in the arch nicely, but if you land at the top of the arch, on this edge, carries on along this edge here, sitting on there. This bit is a little wide, but when I grind that back, I'll still get the world in there, okay, so that's not too bad. And, oh, that's just pushed under. But yeah, so I'll go on like so. So yeah, that's the other side. I ain't going to attack it just yet. Um, but it probably will be in the next clip, so I don't know, it might not be, I don't know yet. But yeah, there you go. Right, on this back bit, obviously I've took this back for now, but I think I've shown you that bit in there. What I'm going to do for this back bit, I was thinking I need to obviously make a way to cover this up with a buck, but I still need to be able to do it. Um, I still need to find out a way so I can get to the rear light in case I need to change bulb or anything. So what I'm thinking, maybe a good idea. Also comments and that feedback on this may be a good idea, but this is what I'm thinking I might do, is at the bottom along here, where like this level with this, at the bottom, I'm gonna get this bar, it's just like about a three quarter inch bar or something, um, square. And um, what I might do is I might cut it to length to fit from here to here, and then what I'll do is I'll then weld that to the floor. Once I weld that to the floor, I might then cut the sheet that will go for the back here of the bug and I will drill holes in that and I'll drill holes in this and I'll rivet, instead of bolt, I'll rivet some little hinges to this bar at the floor and to the sheet and then what I can do, when this is in the floor welded I can then rivet the sheet on and then that will hinge down and up um, and then on the back here I'll drill a few holes and I'll either put nut rivets in and bolt it in and just unscrew it like a formal anarchy bolt with like five nuts or, or bolts, screws, whatever, sorry, or like some Zeus fasteners or something, just something quick and easy, so I just go bump, bump, down, done, sort of thing. Um, so yeah, there we go, I thought I'd let you know, that's just a little idea, but give me some ideas if you've got any, so. Sweet! Right, I've measured out that bit across the bottom, um, for this bar, where this bar would go. I've measured it out to be 53 and a half inches. So, should we measure out? Goggles 
science lab goggles. I don't know what they are, but they've done the job so far. So, see. Hey, bro, don't fix it. One bar cut, two, three and a half inches. I'm now just going to size up and uh, it should be alright. So, sweet. Right, um, it should be about an hour. Girlfriend's helped as well, so thank you. Um, what I've done is, you know, I said about doing the bar across the bottom here. Well, I thought instead of before I put the bar in, it might be good to get the floor in so the floor's all flat and straight then put the bar then do this back bit obviously i cut this side already so i'll do that first but i thought obviously to do the floor i've got to do a template so me and the girlfriend have cut out the template this took us about an hour or so but here you should go i'll get her to give you a better view but then give us more like it. there's a little bit got to be added here and on that side as well which i have put in i will end up doing a final template and then um test fit that one before and then draw it into the metal to cut out but I'm going to probably do the floor with like maybe 3 mil or something 2 mil I don't know it doesn't have to be very strong stronger um, all I've got to do is this back bit is here that shouldn't be too hard and then um, we'll be on to a winner so yeah that's the end of episode 8 it's just a little one um, got the uh, other side cut for the buck I kind of got an idea of what I'm going to do for the back where the rear lights not going to be. I've started drawing out a template for the floor pan and I've... don't know what else I've done. That's one thing I've definitely done though. But yeah, I'm going to, going to get the other side welded in and then I'm going to design the floor pan and get some metal for that. Probably going to do like 3 mil metal or something like that, maybe just a bit thicker. Um, I'm going to do that in first and then I'm going to do the back so I can get that bar at the bottom in nice and straight and welded to that bottom plate. Um, also... I've got a list of jobs. Um, first, I'm finishing metalwork in the buck. And I'm going to get all that done first. Second job is I'm going to do all the bits in the engine bay. That is intercooler fitted and pipe work, the coolant pipes, air filter, expansion, new expansion tank, etc. Then I've got to fit all the over fenders on the front and rear, get all the holes drilled out, get all the rip nuts in, and everything, get them done. But I'm not going to do back ones until I've done the bucks, so then I can get everything like coming up nicely, whether the over fenders got to the top to the edge of the.